is a foot of half inch pipe. This is six inches of half inch pipe. This is an inch of half inch pipe. And this is another inch of half inch pipe. This is one foot of one and a half inch pipe. And this is a, a half inch valve. This is a downsizer from one and a half inches to half inch. This is a one and a half inch collar. This is a half inch T valve. This is a half inch end cap. And this is a downsizer from one inch to one to half an inch. And we have a one and a half inch end cap here. And this is an inner tube bike valve. First you need to drill a hole into this end cap, one and a half inch end cap. This is the same size as this bike valve. So we're gonna do that now. Start with the turn on. Now we this insert it when it's so now we insert the bike. So now that we've attached the bike valve into the half inch end cap, we're ready to build the rest of the gun. So now we're gonna assemble the gun. First, we're going to take the one and a half inch end cap and coat it with glue. Make sure this is good because there's a lot of pressure here. Then we're gonna stick this piece into the one foot, one and a half inch pipe and make sure it's tight. Normal, normal. Of course. Make sure it's level. Make sure, making sure it's level. Now we will put the half inch to one and a one inch part in, upsize the part in. With some Tighten in 
last piece is the end cap that goes on the end of the handle, which also acts as a pressure chamber. So this piece with glue is now going to go onto here. And press in, and tap in, and that's it. It's beautiful. So here's the gun loaded, and we're now pressurizing it with our bike. Oh, we put a potato in. Put yeah, we put a potato, potato in as the ammunition. It's right there. That's good. That's good. Right now we have water psi, and that should be good to launch. Unplug the. Pull it out. Yes, unplug it. Pull it back. Okay. Now the gun is loaded and ready to fire. We get to a better angle. Shoot it towards the um, current machine. Yes. And it was a wonderful shot, ladies and gentlemen.